Australia in fifth. And uh, Joanna Pretorius uh, of South Africa, the 19-year-old, uh, not taking part. She was down on the start list, but she's uh, got a DNS next to her game, did not start. So Johanna Pretorius not in the competition. Ilsa Hayes leads the competition. Now we're back on the track. Do feel sorry for, for the field athletes. They do get uh, the short straw when it comes to the TV coverage. The track yes. athletes get all the glory. There's Richard Coleman from Australia. We've got Nikki Bushell. As you might hear, hometown favorite, won the 100 meters here. And we've seen a lot of this guy this week, Brent Lakatos of Canada. Yeah, he's gone well. He's been right in every race that he's finished. Am I or saying him right, Lakatos, or is it Lakatos? I think, that, I think that is. I'm not sure. Could be Lakatos, couldn't it? But Lakatos, I think, is how a Canadian would say. It's hard to say. Mm -hmm. And Zhao Yufi, China. I don't have a Canadian wife, so I'm not so good on the Canadian pronunciations. Ah! Yu Shiran. He looks happy. And there's Lee of China in lane seven. And outside him, another strong competitor, Alan Duani of Kuwait. And then Silver of Brazil makes up the race. You can see the Coleman's in lane two that they're not using lane one. Gets more and more challenging. In lane one, that turn is just a bit sharper. And when you're going at speed, and it's Silva here, out in lane nine. So eight people on the track. So, Mickey Bushel, one to look for. Brent Lakatos, Zhao of China will be worth looking for, and Yu of China. In fact, all of the Chinese competitors, Lee of China, Richard Coleman of Australia as well. Yeah, there's, it's, any it's of them, any yeah. of them could win, really. They really could. Let's see who's away quickly. It looks to me like Brent Lakatos going very well from Canada and Mickey Bushel in lane three. Mickey Bushel in the white, Brent Lakatos in the black and white. Is Lakatos in the lead at the moment? Up against the Chinese competitor Lee. It's Lee against Lakatos. Lee from China against Brent Lakatos and the other Chinese competitors coming through. But it's Lee who gets it from China. Uh, Lakatos in uh, second place. And I couldn't see which of the other two uh, Chinese competitors it was, but one of them uh, got the bronze. The Paralympic record. And Lee broke his own Paralympic record right there. Lee Huzhou of China, 23 years of age, 25-61. Brent Lakatos of Canada with a personal best, 25-85, and it was Zhao of China with 26 uh, dead with a, a personal best. And Mickey Bushel of Great Britain, although he set a European record, 26-32, he's out of the medals. Yu of China, 26-46. Super fast race all the way along. Really impressive. Just look at Lakatos and look at how his wheels are jumping in between turns because with that follow through, his hands come up so high. Pulling the chair off the ground. So disappointment for Mickey Bushel, but he had his moment in the 100 meters. He did. He went really fast in the 100 meters, that's for sure. After winning that 100 meters, though, you kind of think that he might have been in there in the 200 as well. So I can confirm that the world record holder is still Chris Waddell. <laughs> My co-commentator is still the world record holder in that event. You kept quiet.